New firmware is now available for the Panasonic S1H and the Atomos Ninja 5 that enables ProRes RAW recording over HDMI. In this video, we will take you through how to set up the Panasonic S1H and the Ninja 5 for Apple ProRes RAW. Connect a full-sized HDMI cable to the S1H and now connect to the Ninja 5. Now that both devices are connected, let's take a look at the in-camera settings on the Panasonic S1H. To begin, turn on the Panasonic S1H. Rotate command dial to manual video mode. Press menu. You are now in the video menu. Navigate to image format. Set HDMI raw data output to on. Press yes to confirm. Head over to time code. Set HDMI time code output to on. You can now trigger record on the Atomos over HDMI. Press back. Set record quality to your preferred resolution. In this case, we are setting the device to 5.9K 25 frames per second. For uninterrupted recordings, let's turn off the power save mode. Navigate to setup menu, go to monitor, Display 1, power save mode, set sleep mode to off. Now it's time to set up the Ninja 5. Press the power button. A message will now appear indicating your Ninja 5 has detected a raw input signal. Press OK to confirm. An activation page will appear. Please take a note of your unique key or device identification number. Using a computer, navigate to atomos.com forward slash activation. Scroll down the activation page. Enter your email address with the unique key or device ID number from your Atomos 5. Choose Apple ProRes RAW. Press submit. You will now get a unique activation code. This code will also be emailed to you. Enter this code on your Ninja 5. Press confirm. The Ninja 5 will now reboot to activate the Apple ProRes RAW codec. Please note to record in 5.9K 25 frames per second in ProRes RAW, you will require a compatible high-speed SSD to use with your Atomos Ninja 5. Tap on the top left for your input menu. All your settings should be automatically set for the Ninja 5. Confirm trigger over HDMI is set to on. Navigate to record menu to confirm settings. Navigate to the meters tab. If you are not using an analog input source, toggle off the record buttons and set monitor to channel 1-2. Finally, don't forget to prepare the SSD drive for recording. Navigate to media. Press format. A warning message will pop up to confirm you wish to format your drive. If your drive is secure erase enabled, you can toggle this feature to reset for optimum speed. Now press format drive. This process will take a few seconds before it is complete. With these steps complete, you are now ready to shoot ProRes RAW over HDMI with your Atomos Ninja 5 and Panasonic S1H. Thanks for watching. Go get creative.